Our visit to Kismayo is the latest in our regular contact with the leaders of Somalia's federal member states. The main purpose of our visit is to reaffirm the international community's collective support to Somalia's elections and to discuss the next steps in the process. In our discussion with the President and members of his cabinet, we commended Jubaland for being the first federal member state to start holding upper house elections and emphasized the need for the election of the remaining upper house seats to be completed quickly. This will allow the electoral focus to shift towards the next phase of the federal elections, those for the House of the People. We encourage President Ahmed Madobe and Jubaland's state electoral implementation team to accelerate this process by convening the delegate selection committees comprising elders and civil society representatives and by preparing the polling stations in both Kismayo and Garbahari. We emphasize that these electoral processes must respect the right of women to participate fully in all aspects of public life and that the minimum quota of 30% women's representation should be achieved in Parliament. President Ahmed Madobe, once again, thank you to you and the government and people of Jubaland for your welcome today. Mr. Swan, UN Ambassador, Saif Madera, Norway, Safira the Osud, EU, Sweden. I don't know for Hassan Hamant and Kulan Khan, Sagaso Kaibgalo, and in fact, to Kulan Adu, Muhimha, Wahana, Briority, Kola Sadaha, election in Wadan Khan, so election Wadi Ela, Harad the Kalagur Kalaguchirana. ولكنهم <تصفيق> إلى أن أقول لك أن المشكلة في 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 المشكلة وأنا <تصفيق> ولكن يجب ان يكون هناك اشياء اخرى